Goan cuisine consists of regional foods popular in Goa, an Indian state located along India's west coast on the shore of the Arabian Sea. Rice, seafood, coconut, vegetables, meat, pork and local spices are some of the main ingredients in Goan cuisine. The area is located in a tropical climate, which means that spices and flavors are intense. Use of kokum is another distinct feature. Goan food is considered incomplete without fish. It is similar to Malvani or Konkani cuisine. The cuisine of Goa originated from its Hindu roots, and was influenced by the 451 years of Portuguese colonialization and the century of Muslim rule that preceded the Portuguese. Many Catholic dishes are either similar to or variants of their Portuguese counterparts in both naming or their use of ingredients. Seafood <inaudible> 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 The cuisine is mostly seafood based, the staple foods are rice and fish. Kingfish is the most commonly eaten. Other commonly eaten seafood includes pomfret, shark, tuna, and mackerel. Among the shellfish are crabs, prawns, tiger prawns, lobster, squid, and mussels. The food of Goan Christians is heavily influenced by the Portuguese. Introduction of new foods The Portuguese introduced potatoes, tomatoes, pineapples, guavas, and cashews from Brazil to Goa and consequently India. The chili pepper is the most important aspect of Goan cuisine, it was introduced by the Portuguese and became immensely popular as a very important spice for wider Indian cuisine. The Portuguese also introduced beef and pork, meats that were and still are considered a taboo by Hindus of Goa, to converts to Catholicism. <inaudible> <inaudible> Hindu cuisine Hindu cuisine in Goa is mainly pescatarian and lacto-vegetarian. Hindu cuisine mainly uses less heat, tamarind and kokum for souring, and jaggery for sweetening. It uses asafetida, fenugreek, curry leaves, mustard, and urad dal. It is not very spicy, less onion and garlic are used. It also includes more vegetables, such as lentils, pumpkins, gourds, bamboo shoots, and roots. It is less oily and the medium of cooking is coconut oil. Many parts of coastal Karnataka such as Udupi and Dakshina Kannada have adopted the Goan lacto-vegetarian cuisine, whereas few major parts of Uttara Kannada have adopted the pescatarian cuisine. Popular Goan Hindu dishes include Human humana fish curry and rice sita or bada, also known as kadi or ambat Fried fish Talil noosed fish souk or dabdhabit sukum dry spicy preparation of fish, eaten as a side dish Fish udid methi or udamathi udamathi type of curry consisting of fenugreek and mackerel, a vegetarian version of this dish is also prepared using hog plums or anything sour and tangy, such as pieces of raw mango. Kismer kismera a type of side dish normally consisting of dried fish mostly mackerel or shrimp, onions, and coconut. Dangar, gone fish cutlets. Dangara kalputi, a dish normally prepared from the head of a large fish, with onions and coconut Bhaji or shak, a generic term for stews, curries, and stir-fried dishes made from different vegetables and fruits Bhaji or saka Bhaji, fried fritters with besan batter. Different kind of bhajis can be made by changing the vegetable used with besan. Popular bhajis include those containing onion or chilies. Kot kate Katakatam varan, a lentil preparation often made with coconut milk tempered with mustard, hing, curry leaves, and chilies, served as an accompaniment to rice for the naivadya, prepared during all Hindu festivals, and an integral part of wedding feasts. Tandak, a dish with beans and cashews as the primary ingredients. Tandaka different varieties of sweets made from rice and lentils, such as payasu, patoli, madgain and kheer. Got some different varieties of pickles and papads lanis or papada. Solachi kadi, a spicy coconut and kokum curry. Kadi. Topic: <coughs> Catholic cuisine. Catholic cuisine in Goa is a fusion of Indian and Portuguese cooking styles. Vinegar made from the toddy of local coconut trees is used to give the zingy taste to the meat dishes. Popular Goan Catholic dishes include 
Embot tik, a spicy and sour curry prepared with fish. Arroz doce, a Portuguese derivative of kheer, sweetened rice custard. Balchow, a curry made with prawns, shrimp. Bebinka, a multi-layered baked pudding traditionally eaten at Christmas. Kafrael, a masala marinade mostly used for chicken or fish made from coriander leaves, green chilies, and other spices. Kanya de galena, a type of chicken broth served with rice and chicken. Chamuca, a gone, Portuguese derivative of the samosa. Chorizo, a spicy pork sausage. Croquettes, fried minced beef rolls, a common snack among gone Catholics and the Portuguese. Feijoada, a stew brought by the Portuguese. It is made with meat, beef or pork, beans, and cabbage. Patolio or patoli, a dish of turmeric leaves stuffed with rice, dal, jaggery, and coconut. Roast beef and beef tongue, popular entrees at gone celebrations. Roast omelette, an omelette drowned in spicy chicken or chickpea gravy and served with pau Portuguese gone bread. Samarain kai kodi, gone curry made with fresh and dried prawns. Sana, a dry rice cake, a variant of Italy. Salantul kodi, a spicy coconut and kokum curry. Sorpatel, a very spicy pork dish eaten with saunas or pau gone bread, spelled the same way as in Portugal. Bindaloo, a spicy curry traditionally made with pork. The name is derived from the Portuguese term for a garlic and wine vinho e alho or vina de los marinade. Contrary to popular versions made outside Goa, a traditional vindaloo does not contain any meat besides pork. It also does not contain any potatoes nor is its name related to aloo potato. Shakuti – type of curry made with roasted grated coconut and pieces of chicken or lambcashew ladus, nevrio, haje, revdio, peta, purin poli, soccer bot, madgain, and payasa are other well-known dishes. There are several types of halwa, such as dali kappa halwa made from red gram, cashew halwa, mango halwa, banana halwa, pumpkin halwa, and dodal. <laughs> See also